why are you buying a book on how to model you're not the only beautiful person in this world honey and it's the reason why you're probably getting rejected from agencies so i'm gonna actually break down the steps to actually get scouted from an agency and i got rejected left right center so hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is mary also known as mary remains hot and i model as well as looking into studying medicine one day as well as just trying to go about life the way i can and i thought i'd show you guys on my journey and this episode will be about talking to you about how to get scouted by an agency this video is in honor of the month where i started pursuing modeling last year november i started pursuing modeling and it's only till this year july when i got scouted professionally so i thought i'd let you know what on earth was happening during those months and how to avoid the journey that i've been through number one is to not pay for anything the reason why those of people get scammed is because they're paying and you don't pay please don't pay number one in fact scrap that i'm gonna start with number one okay number one is rejection rejection write it down rejection rejection you're gonna get rejected like for me what i did is that when i first started i searched up on models.com as everyone does and everyone says go to all the agencies and apply right i send my digitals i'm applying 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 apply, apply. and it's either that you don't get anything back or you get rejected and like oh i'm sorry we don't really have a reason to tell you that we're not gonna accept you xyz and i got rejected left right center so it left me one of the choices where i felt that i needed to pay i went to go and pay which no one should do please don't pay don't pay for no agency don't pay for none of that but i paid and i paid quite some of money learn from my mistakes and all i got was just one test shoot so i'm gonna actually break down the steps to actually get scouted from an agency and the type of digitals you should send and the reason why you're probably getting rejected from agencies and the reasons which i wish i knew but number one i still need you to let you know that you need to be okay with rejection because rejection is a thing that you're gonna constantly get even models now who've been signed to agencies who have been through development who have booked jobs they still get rejected like it's not you're not the only beautiful person in this world honey i'm sorry you're not the face that everyone's always looking for so you always need to understand that like this shift some jobs may not be for you some agencies might not be for you so really it's time to get your head around that number one is digitals how are you taking your digitals if you're watching this right now you probably have an electronic device which is probably an iphone samsung you name it camera whatever what i need you to do in fact i could show you right now i'm wearing a basic digital fit wait i'm gonna have to take you downstairs because i don't think i'll be able to size you in my room it's not that big but what i need you to do is get in front of a camera have someone shoot for you your mom dad older sibling younger sibling whatever and i need you to wear a basic fit i guess what i'm wearing a very basic fit jeans a basic camisole top or a basic white top or whatever and usually preferably have an actual hair i actually had a wig when i had my digits <laughs> took my digits not this one there was like a curly one and i need you to practice looking in the camera when you look in a camera of an iphone i'm going to use my phone case for example there's three of them or there's one i need you to practice looking into each one so take one photo look into this one look into this one look into this one and see which one's better for you or if it's better you look straight at the case instead so i need you to look and i need you to stand then i need you to move to your side give me a portrait look to the side look at me and then i need you to then come back again look to the side look at me and then i need you to also be really free moving when you take these photos so for example when they ask for a video because loads of people ask for video submissions as well i really need to be like this look do you understand what i'm trying to say and as well as that you need to introduce yourself so let me quickly go over that i'm gonna redo this for you 
So, hi, my name is Mary, and I'm five foot nine, and I really want to be part of this agency. Okay, let me just be enthusiastic. Give me a second. Hi, guys, my name is Mary, and I'm five foot nine, and I would love to be part of this agency. I really enjoy doing this, 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 and that. And I think I'll be really great addition to your agency. Yabba, yabba, yabba. Anyways, let me get back to sitting so we can actually sit down and talk. So, um, number one, that's how you should do your digital. I'll show you how I sent mine. It took me over four goes to send mine. And you need to understand that this is really just trial and error when getting signed to an agency. And you shouldn't beat yourself up to be signed to one because it will happen in don't worry and i would also say when you search up on models.com don't go and search up the top agencies i'm not saying as much as you want to if you've already tried all of the agencies you've got rejected then go straight to the top ones go to the mother agencies search up mother agencies and not only models.com go on instagram instagram type in mother agencies in where i'm living model agencies in london model agencies in birmingham model agencies and actually search them up and look through them and look wait do i look like i want to be represented by this said what do you call it agency and i think those are the ways which it will help you please don't pay i'm saying this again for the third time you don't need to pay for anything. I know most people, they do go out there and they get like professional digitals. I don't think you need to get professional digitals unless you've already been signed to an agency and they're like, wait, we want you to like have your fresher digitals. We're going to get this sorted out for you. But you may have to add like a fee and it's usually the cheapest thing, like 20 pounds. Okay, that's not cheap. We're in a cost of living crisis. But you know what I mean? Compared to 160, 260 pounds of what these modeling agencies, these scammers are putting out there for you. So please, please, please be mindful, guys. And understand and be patient. Please be patient. I wish someone were to tell me, Mary, be patient. Mary, don't worry. Mary, be patient. Like, so I am explaining my journey quickly just a little bit to give you more context because I just wanted to help you and get the advice out first so you can kind of understand what was I doing in those six months before I was professionally scouted so what I was doing is that and you can take advice to this as well what I was doing is that I decided I wanted to go into modeling last year November I got rejected from all these agencies and I was just like okay cool I'm gonna go and pay for a shoot because I actually still want to get that experience I pay for this shoot i go on the shoot i enjoy myself I had a great time it was makeup hair and i loved it i had such a good time and then after that they're just like okay so we want to sign you up you're going to be the next naomi campbell yeah but yeah but yeah and i'm just like oh my god mom look do you hear this and then she's just like yeah that's great that's great and you hear the feeling like eh, and they're like mm. And I'm so upset I didn't have to drag my mom through that, but um, and my and my dad, and but anyways, after that, I get the comp cards. <gasps> I still have the comp cards. Wait, I have the comp cards somewhere, guys. Guys, I can't find the comp cards. But anyways, long story short, I had comp cards and they emailed it to, not emailed it, they sent it to the wrong person's house. And there were just so many signs. I should have known, like, this wasn't legit. And then one month goes by, I hear nothing. Two months go by, I hear nothing. Three months go by, I'm just like, okay, this is a scam. What do I do? So what I did end up doing was that I just started, what do you call it? trying to create my own test shoots so as a model when you get scouted to an agency you're gonna go through a stage of development if you haven't already been developed already and what i was doing was kind of mimicking this process so if you haven't been scouted and you want to be scouted please try and and you've been rejected for a while and thinking okay maybe something with my look is something i have to do something i need to change I would definitely recommend getting yourself used to the scene and that can be just making creative friends and being like hey i would love to model for your artwork or i would love to model for your photography work and that's genuinely what i did if you go to my instagram now and you go to my model 
<laughs> my model Mary section on my stories, you will see that I literally started properly through experience helping my friends. Be like, oh, I wouldn't mind modeling for your makeup business. Oh, I would love to model for your hair business. Get there and put yourself out to work and show yourself in these different scenarios because realistically, that's what's going to happen when you do get to the testing site the testing bit of your journey so really just put yourself out there like i would ask my photography friends and be like hey i would love to model for like your projects if you have any please like let me know and they will put me out there and i'll take photos and they'll try different things and you get used to posing and putting yourself out there as well as that's your makeup friends as well because once they get that camera to record that content you need to be ready so once you like kind of put yourself into that place and even if you don't have these friends or you don't know these people always try and put yourself out there to try and connect to such people even like online be like searching up oh new makeup new makeup businesses new hair businesses you know new clothes businesses and dm these people on instagram in the areas you are and literally put yourself out there and be like hey i would love to model hey i would love to do this and really it just shows you and just prepares you for the next stage and then i can get into testing in the next video and how to like go through testing and stuff i'm actually still in the testing development stage and i can't lie for most models it takes around six to a year six months to a year so really it's just about going with the process also modeling is not one of them things which you can learn through a course it's not one of them things you can learn through a course don't go and buy a course don't go and buy an agency you can't do that that's not what modeling is and for me i had to learn the hard way i didn't buy a course though but i know loads of people who are buying courses and buying books why are you buying a book on how to model like guys it's not that hard but it's also not easy so it's one of them things you really do have to kind of learn on the job but you can't do that unless you're put on the job so in order to be put on the job you have to be put for an agency i'm telling you guys stages on which you can prepare yourself before you put yourself forward for these said agencies and for these said jobs and what else advice do i have um yes yeah, so the last stage is when you get called in some people get called in um i've been called in once previously before my agency i'm signed to now and um honestly just be so hospitable 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 <laughs> okay when you get called in this is like really exciting because it's like oh i might be signed really just be your most genuine self the reason why they're calling to sign and see you in person is to see like hey is this person lying about their stats who do they really look like and really just get to know you as a person so it's really great to be your authentic self and put yourself out there and for me it's really easy for me to now be my authentic self because i have learned who i am and i've been able to express who i am because i understand and i actually love who i am and i can put a video on that later but yeah i think that's all i have to say so far so yeah these are the steps and stages and just advice i have genuinely to being signed to an agency because you got this guys like it's might take some time and might take a lot of rejection but at the end of the day you have this in the bag don't let rejection get to you it's never gonna be it's never personal it's ne never take it personal never take it personal because it's not just to you it happens to me yeah it probably happens it happens to the models out there right now who are booking work and getting work like it's not just to you it's, it happens to everybody so don't take rejection seriously and don't take rejection personally don't go and buy these scamming pages don't go and buy books on how to model try hardest to put yourself out there and try and start modeling for small businesses small campaigns small makeup artists people who are around your area your photography friends try and model for them and really just put yourself out there you've got this if you really have this dream inside of you and you really can't like sleep at night and you're thinking yeah i really need to do this put yourself out there and you will you will see that you can be a model and i believe in you guys if you're really out there believing that you can do this you can you totally can and so i'm gonna get ready for school so yeah i'm gonna go now bye bye guys
make sure you like comment and subscribe please guys i honestly need you guys to run it up for me i'm trying my hardest like i want to live in a cute penthouse in new york city one day and not only that i w i have big dreams for my life and i can't do that unless you guys help me so you know i would just love for you guys to help me and i'll be able to help you guys too so you know we're, we're helping each other we'll help each other anyways please like comment subscribe and let me know what other like videos you want and share this video to your modeling friends to people who want to start modeling and let me know what do they think do they think i'm speaking facts do they think i'm speaking trash what do you think like let me know so i'll see you guys later and i'm gonna head off to school now so oh she's not wearing this i'll show you my fit actually i'm gonna come back and i'm gonna show you my fit give me a second if i show you guys my fit so it's basically a basic pillow i'm gonna get the clips out it's just that i need my hair on my face now so i get to actually uni and then i'll take it out maybe even on the journey there's construction going on behind me so i'm not gonna record this for too long but it's a basic i'm gonna get my sambas on and i just think this is so cheek the only issue i have is that it's a bit um, i don't like how long it is so i'm thinking i'll like crop it how i'm gonna do this i don't know i was thinking like cropping it just a bit because it looks so cute like this like i love the color and the way the fur is but yeah i'm gonna try and like crop it so i think i'll just use my pins and just like pick it up Oh, it's so loud i hate it so much okay <gasps> that's smart okay next one and i don't really care about the clip showing to be fair on the side i just care that it's not that high yeah this is girl math guys this is girl math guys and then my bag my long short bag this is gum up. Anyways, I thought that's my outfit. So it was really nice seeing you guys. Like I said, like, comment, and subscribe. Share this to other people so I can move out, get my own place, drive my nice Porsche McCann, buy everyone a Mercedes GLE. You know, like, I have big dreams. I have big goals with the money and wealth I will require. And in order for me to get there is through you guys helping me. So please help me.